Hi guys, Perry here, and in this video I'm going to show you how you can add text to any JPEG image. Um, to do that we're going to use a tool called Good Annotations, so the first thing you're going to have to do is head over to goodannotations.com, um, then head to Tools, scroll down the page uh, to the Learn About All Our Tools section. On the left they have a Text Tools category. And then in there, you can see add text to JPEG. So you click that and you are taken to the main page for add text to JPEG. I'll put the link straight for this page into the description below so you don't have to follow the way that I got here. Um, but what we want to do on this page is click this button that says add text to JPEG now. What would you like to do? Um, so I've got a JPEG image on my laptop that I want to update or add some text to. So let's click, let's upload an image, find the JPEG file that we want to change or add text to, hit open. And here you go. So here's our JPEG file that has been opened up in the Good Editations editor. Um, on the left, you can see all of the editor tools the one we're going to use today is the text tool. So I'm going to click that. And we've got a few text options here. We have add a title, add a subtitle, add some body text, and then some really cool call out elements like sticky notes and examples that you can paste onto your um, JPEG image and then just edit the text within. But for this example, I'm just going to simply add a title to this JPEG. There we go. So that's been edited. And then we can edit it. So let's say, um, let's pretend that I'm creating a banner image for a blog article that I'm writing called Top 10 Cities to Visit in Europe. Now, obviously my text is a bit big for the image that I've given, uh, I've uploaded. So let's just make that a bit smaller. And maybe I don't want it on four lines, so I'm going to increase the width size there we go and then i'm going to place it in the middle and there we go i've added the title to our jpeg file um and that i can use now in blog articles or websites um, you can do a few customizations here so you can you know make it um, unbold bold italic and maybe even change the color so let's actually maybe try a white out mm, i don't like that maybe a purple you know that looks really cool now I think it's ready for my blog article. So all I need to do now is download it. So you can hit more and then download as image, or you can hit the share button and you get a URL that you can just send to someone through your favorite messaging platform, or you can use that link to embed into your website or blog. Um, so I'm just gonna click the file that we downloaded and there you go, you can see the text that we've added to our JPEG file. Okay, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please hit the subscribe button below and you'll see more content like this.